This guy called Matt Shea, who orchestrated the Vice hit piece against Andrew Tate, has now come out in another Vice documentary saying that Andrew Tate tricked and forced him into having a fight and beat him up badly. One of the scariest moments that happened was he said, oh, do you want to come to the fight gym and just film me sparring a professional UFC fighter? It might be some good footage for your documentary. I said, yes. And when I got there, he said, put some gloves on, you're fighting. And I'd never boxed or done anything like that before. <laughs> Within seconds, Andrew Tate was punching me in the face. Um, and he was like, yeah, 10 more rounds, let's go. You know, you're, you're in this well. And I sort of was like, can I fight someone my own size? And he said, yeah, okay, this guy. And he pulled over this guy who was my own height, but like twice the size of me in terms of muscle. And he just like wailed on me. I felt like I was gonna pass out. Jamie, you must have been kind of worried at that point. Yeah, there's... <laughs> what is interesting about this though, is if you look at the fight that Matt Shea describes, Andrew is clearly going very easy on him. Jamie, come to me. Oh, you're bleeding already. It's only round one. It's only warmed up. Keep going, bro. We've got 10 more rounds. No fucking way. No, 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 no. Men defined by their capacity to inflict violence. What do you guys think of this? And do you think that Andrew Tate will seek some kind of revenge for what Matt has said about him once he's out of jail?